Hello, and welcome to Joyce's Application Questions, JAX. My name is Mark Burleson, and I'm a senior application engineer with Joyce Dayton. Today, we're going to discuss rotary cam limit switches. Rotary cam limit switches are useful in controlling the motion of industrial equipment. In front of me are three of our most common limit switches. This one right here is our LS7 limit switch. It is available with up to 2,800 input revolutions, it comes with a NEMA 4 enclosure, and has single pull double throw limit switches. This limit switch is good for most industrial applications. These are our LS8 limit switches. This one has two limit switches in it. This one has four. The LS8 is available with up to 12,000 input revolutions. Why is this important? For example, if you had a 25 to one ratio jack it would take 100 turns of the input shaft to move one inch. With 30 inches of travel, that would mean you need to have 3,000 input revolutions going into the limit switch, which is more than what the LS7 could handle. The LS8 is also available with a NEMA 4, NEMA 7, or NEMA 9 enclosure rating. The LS8 is available with single pull double throw switches or double pull double throw switches. The double pull double throw switches are useful when you want to have an indicator light come on or a siren. It also grants you some additional flexibility with your control system. The LSA can also come with a geared potentiometer for position feedback. Joyce Dean offers limit switches that can meet many specifications. Contact us today and let us know your application requirements. Mm -hmm.